Hello and welcome back, it's Tuesday, so it's another factory tour and welcome to Rocky Desert in Santa's factory, my name is Minturis and we've been doing quite a lot. As you've been seeing my last factory tour, you might see the new power plants we built. Not quite happy with it yet, but it's going to be perfect and well... Some of you have been asking how much time I have I spent in this world. So let me show you. In here is the time plate at the moment. It's 37 hours, almost 38 hours. And uh, well, that is uh, 36 hours running the game. So sometimes I just need to wait for some resources. And sometimes I even get lunch. But well. What have we done? As you can already see, I made a coal factory or a coal power generator factory and not 100% to my liking, but that's mostly because, well, you cannot lower the plateau just above the generator. So I'll, I'll show you what I mean in a few minutes. But, well, there's more. There's a big surprise in the end. I hope you guys are going to like it because, well, in the last... Oh, I fell down. In the last uh, factory tour, I told you guys I was going to go for oil. And I got oil. And I even got the oil plant and refineries up and running. But, well, we'll check them out in a few minutes. Let's first take a look at uh, this beautiful, beautiful well, power central because that's kind of what it is. What I wanted to do is kind of place uh, the foundations over uh, the top, but well, as you can see, it does not let me do it. Otherwise, it would have been a perfect factory and those pipes would come out quite a bit and that would have been beautiful but well I'm not able to do that so I'm going to keep this section until we get the next line of fuel uh, or next line of power and that's the fuel station but we still need to do a lot of things for that so this is kind of, I build it around it. I'm, I'm, if you got some great ideas, leave it in the comment down below. But it took me quite some time to build this, so, well, we're not going to waste a hall, factory hall, because, well, I could have built a factory hall around this one. And in the end, we will do that, but I kind of need uh, two more resources, and that's the uh, enlist, uh, no, the beam. Let's check that out. Which one was it I needed? It is the encased industrial beams. So that's kind of the next one we're going to build in the last part of this section. Because that's what we need for the hardened frames. And so on next level, we can focus totally on that. But maybe we'll even do the beams in this part. Because we got a lot of space left and we don't need that many beams. As you can see, I already made a lot of samurais. They are costing us a lot of power. We are using only 360 megawatt, but that's because not everything is running. As you can see, this doesn't take that much power. It produces a few more status and it's only for producing. Everything is kind of backlogged because I spend a lot of time building a secret project. And we're just going to show you show you that in a few minutes or a few seconds, I guess. That yeah, it's going to be a few seconds. This is still the copper factory. We expanded it a little bit. We bit one extra worker, and this is kind of where the steel goes up. But it's almost fully backlogged. And this is the secret project. And you might be wondering, why did he just build a bridge? Well, I'm going to show you. And because it's like the oil is quite far away, this map is 1800 meters away. And you might be wondering why I left a gap in between that one Because I want to show you guys some stuff, but somehow 
I don't see what I need to see. So we're going to drive all the way to the oil factory. That's a nasty bugger is going to get try and gas me. This bridge is quite a long bridge and it has pillars every ten foundations, so every eleven block is a foundation block and will go down to the bottom. Cable management in the power is on the left top and it goes well as far as I could do it every time. But well as you can see oil isn't close by. And that's well that that's quite annoying. But then you might be wondering, I was already producing oil, I said, yes. And why aren't I transporting it to the factory? Well, because we have a little refinery at the island where the oil is being produced. So that's the most important reason. We got like three oil resources there. And let me show you the big secret of this bridge. Underneath this is everything being transported. So under these factories, and uh, let me show you, I've made this. I'm not quite sure if I'm going to close it all up. I definitely want to. It, it might look cool. I even thought of building, making every uh, pillar red, like the Brooklyn Bridge, something like that, a little bit of inspiration. But this is kind of the main back bone of this whole thing. It was one hell of a project. It took me a lot of time and I don't think it's finished yet. So I'm definitely going to do something with paint. So that's why I left these little holes in it. it it's bringing all the stuff to the factory as we speak. I haven't built the uh, depot where it's going to be arriving but well that's something we going to do in the next episode and the next Lex play that's going to be out next Thursday so you might want to check that out and then you're going to see more of this amazing bridge because it's far from finished I do definitely want to make it better all right so this is kind of my refinery I do think I want to make a one more we finally got to get plenty of oil and I even got one more oil stuck there so well there's going to be a lot more it doesn't feel like doesn't feel like that's an mk3 so I'm going to check that out in this enormous structure there is chain. oh I was out of metal because I had to walk a lot of time. Still don't have the blade runners. This is where the three beams are coming in and that hole is going to be closed as well. Three beams are coming down here and they go to that section and as I see that's not a K3 bell. That's kind of funny because I did program it to be an entry through belt. Oh well, now it is. And these are the refineries. As you can see we got plenty of oil. These things are filled up. And this is a road to the refinery. We cleared it all from the animals. And well this is kind of a nice spot because it got a lot of flowers that we're going to use to paint. So in the next few let's plays we're also going to paint the building and I definitely already got my style worked out so I know what I'm going to make it look like and what color we're going to use. I hope you guys all enjoyed this little factory tour because well I've been building a lot. I'm far from finished. Well, well, I'm definitely going to keep this up because now we got oil production and that's kind of neat. Oil production always neat. So, I definitely want the Blade Runner so if anybody knows how I need to get them because then I need to look that up. But I still don't have them. 
I am going to drive my way back because, well, it's a long way back. Thank you for watching and leave your comments, likes and thumbs up down below. And if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. It really helps me out and it's tremendous support will keep this channel running. So see you all on the next last play. It's going to be out on Thursday and the other one is going to be out on Saturday. See you soon. Let's keep building.